Hello and welcome to this Indigo tutorial on Fireflies. Fireflies are bright little specks appearing sort of randomly in your render. And they can be quite persistent and quite annoying, so I'll give you five ways to make them go away. The first method is simply rendering your scene for longer. The path tracing mode is struggling with a combination of glass and a small light source, but after 10 minutes in GPU mode, the fireflies have actually started to form caustics. This brute force approach is of course not ideal for when you need low render times, such as in animations, so let's continue with method 2. Arch glass for your architecture scenes. If you have any thin flat glass panels, you'll want to use this option. It's a glass approximation that makes it a huge amount quicker to render but as you can see, Suzanne isn't looking too good anymore, since we're missing out on the refraction effect of the glass. So for our particular scene, it's probably a good idea to disable that, and continue to method number 3. This is a new feature for Indigo 4, and it's called Contribution Clamping. This is perhaps the most effective way to kill fireflies. It simply limits the maximum brightness of each individual sample, thus preventing fireflies from happening. But it's also preventing the light from coming through the window panel, because it's a biased feature, which limits the caustic samples in brightness. So if we want a physically correct way to kill the fireflies, we'll have to move on to method 4. By using a more sophisticated render mode, such as bidirectional path tracing, will end up much more quickly with beautiful looking caustics. However, there's still the occasional firefly inside Suzanne's head, and we'll tackle this using method number 5, increasing the super sampling. This increases the internal resolution of the render. It shouldn't affect the performance too much, but it will increase the memory usage quite a bit. As you can see, we have beautiful caustics forming, with no distinguishable fireflies going on. If you still have fireflies in your scene, go back to step number 4 and select an even more sophisticated render mode, bidirectional with MLT. This is the most robust render mode in Indigo, and it can render very complex lighting. However, for simpler scenes, it's probably slower than the other render modes, so use with care. To sum up, any of these methods, or a combination of them, should help with getting rid of fireflies. Render your scene for longer, use arch glass when possible, contribution clamping for very easy firefly filtering, use a more sophisticated render mode, and increase super sampling. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for listening.